All right, hello everybody. My name is CMason1015, and I'm in a test world, a creative world. Um, I'm just testing out some video capabilities here, and uh, I've had to do some resets and trial and error and stuff like that. Um, while I'm here, let's make a quick video just to see how it turns out. And I've been playing around in my uh, server with chicken farms. And I really like the hoppers and stuff. They, they do a good job of taking care of my chickens and stuff for me. This is a pretty standard chicken farm. Um, automated chicken farm, anyway. And you have your chickens that you've got all up in the water here. And as they lay eggs, the eggs fall down to... A hopper that's sitting right behind that piece of cobble right there. The hopper feeds into this uh, dispenser. As soon as anything feeds into the dispenser, it triggers this redstone pulser and, of course, shoots out the egg. The egg hopefully becomes a chicken and falls down. Um, the chicken falls down onto this stone slab, and then once in a while a second dispenser jumps on and uh, uh, pushes out a uh, bit of lava. Baby chickens being half a block high don't get uh, burned or anything by that, but the adult chickens being a block high actually do get burned. And then what happens is they drop their, their seared flesh drops down into a hopper right behind this, and then a sorting set of hoppers takes over, and um, you've got chickens, and you've got feathers. And that's all fine and great. I decided to overly complicate things, <laughs> and created a different kind of a chicken farm that cooks automatically also. So what happens is the chickens get bred in this 4x4 slot, and in this 4x4 slot there are four hoppers underneath which ca capture any eggs that um, that get, uh, what, what do they call it when chickens lay eggs, yes. Those legs uh, run over to these droppers, which then pull up to this hopper and this chest, and uh, as soon as this chest, sorry, as soon as this hopper is full, um, a couple things happen. And it's almost, this chest is almost full. A couple things happen. The hopper shoots out a signal to this little switchy dealy here. To, well, this is an RS NOR latch here. The RS NOR latch turns off. This, this redstone torch turns off, which actually lets this little pulse timer run. In addition, the, um, it also shoots an arrow out of this dispenser onto this button, which turns on and keeps on a, um, this signal, which turns off these guys here, these guys are all connected to um, two sets of sticky pistons, one here and one back there. And what goes on there is that water floods out of, uh, out of there, pushes the chickens into this channel. They go that pushes them to this channel, they fall down on this half slab, and then um, after a minute, remember, arrows disappear, so this goes on for a minute, so that gives plenty of time for all the chickens to land, and then um, as soon as that's done, it shoots another signal down to this guy here, which is another or RS NOR latch, which again shoots out a, a brief thing of lava 
just a pulse of lava, just enough to set the chickens on fire. They all die, and their seared burned flesh goes down here. Now you're seeing a couple things in here, like eggs and chicken and stuff like that. Um, we're now on 1.6.2, 1.6.1. They were glitching all over the place, and I was just like, okay, I'm going to give up, and this is not going to work. Um, but anyway, let's, um, let's see how this works. So let me creatively uh, get um, some eggs. Eggs. And uh, we'll go ahead and do that real quick. Um, it, I've been letting this go, as you can see from the chest down below. I've been letting this go for quite some time just to see how everything runs. So let's go ahead and fill up the chest. Right? So then we'll do the hopper. Boom, 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 boom. And then this one will turn everything on. So we see that this shot out the arrow. It's actually shooting. Dang. Let's do this. It didn't work. <laughs> Welcome to Minecraft 101. Not everything works all the time. Okay. So let's see. Yeah, as soon as as soon as this chest empties, the redstone signal of course cuts off. That resets the RS Nor latch, which turns off the dispenser. Um, let's go ahead and try this again. Pull there. And what do I need? Two more eggs? Dos more eggs? Let's just make sure. Hopefully it'll work this time. Hit. There we go. Oh, dang it. Okay. And, of course, none of this works ever like it's supposed to. Okay, there we go. So here go the chickens and all the baby chickens, too. Goodbye. And they go down here. I don't care if the baby chickens burn or not. And then we'll do that. And we see just the baby chickens are left. Here comes the raw... Okay, good. Overly complicated. Probably not very practical. Um, but fun to build, fun to play with anyway. Um, and let's see here. Let me get this stuff put back together. Boom, boom, put a button back in there, and as you can see we're already starting to collect other baby chicks down there. So this is an example of two different types of uh, chicken cookers. I'm not sure which one would be the better one. I suspect it's the easier one to build. Um, but if you want to do some uh, overly complicated uh, redstone and uh, stuff, this would be it. All right, everybody, this is the end of the test video. I am going to sign off. We're going to see how this looks. Maybe if it looks okay, I'll start putting out more videos. Uh, the next thing I'll do is talk about the automatic horse cooker. Um, horse cooker. Cow cooker. We don't cook horses. We don't cook horses. Okay. Talk to you later. Bye-bye. Take care. Adios.